hello guys welcome to my channel this is tin from takeudranshi.com and today we will see how to send email using smtp uh, with php mailer so this video is very very important for sending email uh, using smtp by php mailer so i will suggest you please watch full video because here i will talk you uh, all the important things about php mailer and uh, smtp okay simple uh, mail transfer protocol smtp so we will go through step by step so you can understand uh, what i am teaching you so first we will see a demo and then we will see how to write a code okay so i'm currently on a local host just concentrate on this okay just think about it and when i refresh this page okay so email sent now we need to check our email inbox so you can see take rudranshi email subject okay so this is uh, i'm sending from questions at the take rudranshi.com and the uh, and uh, and re receiver is the kajanan dot kajin at the red gmail dot com. Just think about that. I am currently on a local host, but sending the email from takeudranshi dot com. Okay, so this is important. So we will set uh, it here SMTP server uh, using my C panel. Just click it here. Just log in your C panel and just click on email sorry just email and uh, email accounts so if you have a lots of emails something like uh, christina at the red gmail uh, at the, uh, at the red take to the com questions at the red krishna auto dot com okay it means you have a lots of emails but you have to send one smtp uh, server and through that you can send uh, email uh no matter which domain you are using okay but just you have to uh, set just only one smtp server so you can cho choose one of them but if you have a ssl that would be a plus point so you can choose anyone but uh, i have a ssl which is the questions at the rate krishnarato.com just click it here and uh, okay before uh, talking this so uh, if you don't have a email account you can create it here okay don't worry about that you can create a uh, new account and uh, this account uh, it uh, will show it here so i'm uh, setting up a smtp just click it here set up configuration so ssl tls settings so this is the username and uh, here will be a password okay password how we can set the password so we will see it here and uh, this is the krishnarato.com this is our host name this is the smtp port outgoing means we are sending the email not receiving okay so imap is our incoming and uh, smtp is outgoing so this thing is very important so different different types of email something we have a question at the red krishnarato.com its host name is krishnarato.com this is important this port is important okay and this this is uh, this uh, this will be a uh, different email have the different host name so i want to show you that this things also so i have a different so i have a different email uh, uh, now we have a seen questions at the red krishnarato.com now we will see uh, this one take root dance questions at the red take root dance.com setting up email host okay so its host name is bg69 dot uh, web host dot net so this is important so in our code sections uh, this thing we will apply okay when we write a code so let's see a code okay so uh, this this code will be available on uh, krishnarato.com okay just minute we are showing uh, code uh, krishnarato.com uh, this code will showing uh, you can download free it's free just uh, click it here start learning 
and you can download all of my video tutorials uh, source code from it here it's uh, simple uh, but you donate me uh, that's a plus point for me <laughs> okay so uh, here are a code okay we will see also how we can install php mailer but very very important things is here okay so this is the host name krishnarato.com what it is okay so uh, just come back it here and uh, click on krishnarato just i am setting one smtp account it here one of them I just click it here any you can create so host name is mail uh, uh, which one okay this is as um, ssl because i have a ssl you can see here http so mail outgoing means host name is krishnarato.com just copy this one and just paste it here okay krishnarato.com if you are uh, not using ssl you need to mail dot krishnarato.com you have to paste it here okay we will see step uh, one uh, step by step okay all the codes we will see uh, line by line but I am showing a very very important things it here then we will start uh, line by line so this is the important host name very very important if you are using a gmail okay so you need to smtp at uh, dot uh, gmail dot com okay then you need to your gmail username and your gmail password it here but we are sending the email through a uh, our server so our host name is krishnarato.com and the second uh, is the username so what is the username username is this this is the username just copy and just paste it here okay if you are using a gmail so you type it here your gmail account uh, you gmail uh, id and here are the password okay so what is the password how we can set just come back it here and uh, just just click its passport and uh, generate passport just copy this one and uh, just use this okay I will not uh, change the password because I have already uh, uh, this password used in my websites okay so I will not update but you just need to change the passport and you need to paste it here okay so this is the password okay and here are the password 587 uh, this is the port number 587 587 is uh, important just again click on set up the mail client so outgoing it has a uh, port number 465 okay so 465 uh, which is the TLS and SSL uh, has the port number 587 okay so you need to check both of them one by one okay so questions at the rate take with branch dot com so I am using a different email different domain okay I am using krishnarato.com this is the different domain but I am sending the email from different domain so questions at the rate or take with branch dot com you can use any of emails okay any emails which your C panel it has okay you can also use your gmail you can also use your anything you can use it here okay you are sending from uh, this email from name from name is takerudranshi.com okay so important things we have seen it here this is the from okay port number and passport username and this is the host, host number but we didn't see what is the php mailer okay this is the simple uh, PHP mail library just you need to PHP PHP mailer just search it here just click it here and uh, you need to just copy this composer uh, require PHP mailer so first we will see what is the composer okay just paste it here and just click it here this is the dependency uh, uh, dependency uh, it, it will manage the dependency okay so just you need to download for Windows composer setup okay and click it here and just run it yes 
actually it's taking time okay yes next and this file php dot extens uh, dot exe is very important okay where is your you have uh, installed your php dot exe you have to come and next 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 and finish this will um, uh, complete your uh, composer setup then uh, i have already so then uh, you have to just copy this and uh, go to uh, go to your uh, zamp st doc just come out here just here here st doc and here you can create any uh, project which you want okay control shift m so i am uh, my php uh, php mailer and inside you need to hold the shift key up your keyboard and right click up your mouse and open command window and paste it here control v and you need to enter so after uh, 3 to 5 seconds i mean just take it uh, 5 to 10 seconds uh, your all the library uh, necessary library automatically it will uh, all necessary library or php mailer it will automatically download uh, for us so composer is uh, very uh, uh, important you can see here composer.json has been created okay loading composer repository installing php mailer and it's a uh, downloading when you see gen generating auto load file it means it's a uh, successfully generated okay and inside we need to create our own file okay which is index dot php php and hit yes so just drag and drop it in our code editor and just come back it here copy and paste it here so i will show you uh, line by line so we have a include our uh, ph uh, auto loader php so where uh, this file so this is my project vendor and this auto loader php this is very very important uh, for uh, success uh, for getting success uh, for sending emails successfully okay so you have to include and require this file and we have included the php mailer class use it here so i want to show you where uh, this file php mailer php mailer and you can see src and you can see php mailer dot php this is the class which, which will uh, we are using it here so we have created the object of php mailer this is the smtp we have seen uh, how we can get the uh, host okay and how we can change it uh, you need to change your host name of your server smtp auth it means it will require username and passport okay port number 587 uh, and 465 and uh, from i'm sending from this domain which is, which has a uh, email which is questions at the take to dot com from name your sender name okay and add address this is the recipient address and here are the name and is html uh, is true means we can uh, include uh, uh, the html h1 s2 s3 any html tags uh, in body tag okay and this is the body means all the message will be here if uh, it will not send it is not able to send the email it will show uh, error info and if it is send it will show email send like this so some is uh, important thing i want to tell you also uh, click it examples and uh, here are the lots of examples uh, you can test it using a gmail using a uh, contact form sending a mail simple mail okay all the examples is here how we can send uh, the, with attachment you need to just copy mail add attachment image php uh, mini dot png okay so these files you have to send uh, uh, through this php mailer so i'm sure uh, this video will help you for sending email uh, using smtp and uh, simple emails uh, so if you like this video please subscribe my channel and visit this website and support me uh, so i can uh, make uh, such a video uh, such a more videos for you and uh, you can uh, and also you can get uh, download the source code from it here okay after uploading uh, on a youtube and this video also available it here uh, for download uh, source code